Okay, clip channel. All right, so we're, we got a Rakeda Dick Masterson crossover here. But we are live now. Typically, too. these guys, uh, <laughs> they make masterpieces of disaster they when they are come the together. Birth the American Beauty clip where Ricardo was basically saying how he wants to kill himself, and you know, he's that's the responsible go, choice it, in his life, and how you should never design, deny yourself hedonistic pleasure or whatever. So that was a classic, Ricardo, one of the best clips ever. Let's see what Dick Masterson can drag what out of him the, this time. What about the hot tub clip where he's? <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, alcoholic with That was also classic. All right, here it go, guys. Let's see. What like, would you suck a guy's c to be a better ally? Like, well, it starts off in a strange place well, where they're debating the merits of sucking. All right, so now for those of you who don't know, Dick Masterson actually did suck a man off at Burning Man. Let's go. He Felt admits it. to this. Yep. And he says that he only sucks the biggest of. Yeah. And he says he will suck your if it's big enough. And I'm not kidding about any of that. He actually did give a to a guy at Burning Man and brag about it. So just say. Based. And it's a good question. Like, how good of an ally are you if you're not willing to, yeah. to get a little drippy on your chin? There we go. Um. Yeah, why are you not gay? What do you mean? Why? You don't f guys? Why not? You gotta turn it around on them, I guess. Ricardo really has to think about why he doesn't. F yeah. Die. Like he's really deep in thought about it. He's like, you know what? Now that you bring that up, Dick. Great point. I see Dick's face here. Dick is looking like a cabbage patch kid, isn't he? <laughs> Look at him. This is not. It's time to shave it off. Buddy. It really is. It's time. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. I think so. But wait, then, then they'd have to admit that it was a choice. Like, that would be, that'd be devastating. Right. Yeah. Do you think so sexuality is a choice, Dick? Like, at all? Um, yeah. Uh, I think there's a All right. I don't know what road we're going down, but <laughs> I don't want to be part of it. I do not want to go They're down. like seriously going to debate the merits of being gay and whether they can choose to be gay and or not. Suck a All well, right. like, I mean, Dick has sucked a He has chose to be gay. Well, that's why he had to think about it. He was like, well, you know, I was going to say no, but you can because I did. Well, also, not only that, but Dick Masterson pretends that he's Juju the cow. Yeah. And he used to have his old girlfriend peg him up the ass with a sparkly purple dildo while pretending that he was Juju the cow. Where was this set again? I saw a pot. It was of his ex girlfriend said all this. Limited of amount course. of choice. You can like. <sighs> I don't know. It's so hard telling, to. Ex go ahead. You're telling me you can look in a man's ass and go, I could do that. Like, I, I could get there. Like, I could. I can guy but i can't f all right listen you know how we'll do a joke a sarcastic this is like you know i could to be or not to be it's a so serious contemplation this is nuts or a, a fat chick so that's what makes me pause and go like uh, like I, it's a choice up to a certain point where <laughs> No, it's fine. Keep going. You know, it's like, ah, I, I could see being gay, but I can't see, like, a woman who's, like, you know, 150, 160 pounds. That would be... I what? Hello, darkness. What? Come to talk with you again. Just come out of the closet, That's pal. Like, how gay are you, bro? That is... Well, he'd sooner have sex with... 150 not even overweight. 150 is a good size! You went... Some what curves. The... Let's oh, go. Oh, no, you can't have any ass or tits on them at you all. You have to be a... You have to be a star skeleton. Or, yeah, there, you know? You know shut the like, fuck up. What the f... 150. What the f... Outrageous, right? Yeah, I don't think I'm alone. So he would rather f 
a hairy man's ass. But this is just then it grows well, one fifty. All, all this 160. is is what just woman hatred, misogyny, yeah. like bullshit. I hate women so much. I'd rather suck a dick. It, it just loops all the time. That's a sound just a straight up. Shit. I should have not said that. Fuck. Psycho better not be in the chat. Shit. And that, yeah, that would be like. Uh, Am I cool, guys? For, like, Do I hate women enough? No, no. Am I cool now? Okay. We get it. Guys, guys, if you're my friends, please don't clip that. Please. Waffins, like, you I'm better not... send 10 subs for saying that. You Shit. bastard. Liana, don't say anything, okay? <laughs> this is the I couldn't sound do the bite we. Caesar's winning. Damn it. That's literally like not AI. Shit. Don't worry, Guy, we'll cope it out it. of existence later. Sure. Or I'll just, I'll be like, yeah, I said that. What are you going to do about it? Uh, like, I don't think could. I, I no, I can't. I what if you had to f guy or else you'd have to f two guys? What is this? The f***ing DJ Axel experience? <laughs> the f*** are you talking about? Wait, what is going on? So you have the choice to either be gay or really gay. What You have to choose one. What, are you going to m*** the child or have s*** with the animal? You have to choose one. Like, that was Axel's parable or whatever that he used to do to people. Whoa, he thought it was like this God. epic mind game. It's like, how about I sh you? How about you die? You freak. Wait, that's not that's not a thing. Well, that's the I mean, that's a counselor. That's the question. What if you <laughs> imagine you're in a scenario where you have to fuck one guy or else you have to fuck two guys. What are you going to do? You're going to I mean, I guess, fuck the one. No, you just, you just reject his nonsense. <laughs> just reject this nonsense. This is uh, no, but what if there was a gun to your head? Would you the child then? No, if it, this is no. Just kill me. One guy or two guys, you tell me. Which one is less gay? <laughs> I think you'd go, you have to go with the two guys. You'd have- Of course! Wait, wait! wait. Ricada wants both the men. To f at, like, he wants a dick in his mouth and his ass at the same that's time. That's less gay. Wow. We're reaching new heights here on the Ricada hour. To go with the two. Someone asked us who's not even part of the guzzling laxatives. Guzzling that? laxatives. Not huh? even, I never seen them before. Just went, are you guys gay? What is this entire sector? It's a blurred out. I don't know what that word is, but. Well, okay. As to assert your heterosexuality, you'd be like, out. I can't Foul do this. Staff gifted a sub. I Thank you. Let's go. Right. Let's go, felted, etc. This is gay yeah. as shit. And they're like, well, this is the alternative. And you got to f two guys. You yeah, know, I think so. That's they're the reality. So gleeful about yeah. It. You know? <laughs> no, I, I do think there is like I I'm not gonna go. I I don't know if you can go full like. Uh, Gay versus not gay. I, but I do know that there's some limited control over your sexual appetites, right? Like, Yeah, sure. Pardon me, Dick. Look at Dick Stout here. Watch this. Well, it's because Ricada does weird swinger cock shit all the time. But look at his face. Baldo sex toys. And Watch this, Ash. Look. Control over your sexual appetites, right? Like, Yeah, sure. Sure. That was sauce. Sure, buddy. It's, there has to be. Otherwise, I, I can't figure out why guys are attracted to certain things, like, at all. I'm like, why would you? That's horrifying to me. Yeah, like, it's um, it's kind of weird that, like, Doug Tenapel By and Nick way, Fuentes right behind have said the... Whoa. Dick Masterson's arm, there's a giant dildo. <laughs> why would you? That's horrifying to me. Yeah, like it's um, it's kind of weird that like Doug Tenapel and Nick Fuentes, the creator of Earthworm Jim, and the and Mexican Nick child leader of the white race, yeah, right, have said the most interesting things to me, uh, like in general about like homosexuality. <laughs> okay, listen, guys. I mean, that's not a surprise to me. <laughs> That Nick Fuentes is saying to Dick Masterson the most interesting things about homosexuality, but, um, 
Wow. So, uh, Doug Tenapel, he's like super, you know, religious, <laughs> right wing guy, right? He hates gay people by like a strong margin. So he was part of the uh, the roast of Dick Masterson. Yeah. As you all know, I was definitely the funniest one there. I actually had like like a <laughs> set. You know what my joke to him was? Why? I'm like. Uh, Doug Tunaples here. Uh, yeah, he, he wrote like a, a comic books such as uh, uh, Earthworm Jim. But wait for his next comic, God Hates <laughs> Whoa, buddy. It's a home run, Thank buddy. You. It's a Thank home you. run. Because <laughs> I don't, so I don't Doug, care. Like, Doug on gays is hilarious. He was so right? pissed. He was like... Seething when I said that. Oh. <laughs> Fuentes have said the most interesting things to me, uh, like in general, about like homosexuality. Because I don't, I don't Doug, care. Like, Doug on gays is hilarious, right? He's yeah, like, he's well, great. I only f like I, I'm st like I, I won't f every woman there is. I only f one woman. So what's the difference of like being gay and not f every guy there is? And I'm like. <gasps> I, don't I mean, really get it. that's a hell of an interesting point. They've, I've never heard that before. <laughs> what? But like, I, I there are people like who I have seen change consciously what they're attracted to. What? What do you mean? <laughs> Even Dick's like, what do you mean? Okay, well, uh, so there are guys who are attracted to supermodels, and they will never, ever, ever date a supermodel. So they're like, well, I guess I gotta be attracted to fat girls. Right. So wait, right. is this and you, just you with your wife, or what? I don't know what's happening Is this here. just, like, projection from him, or what? This is odd, to say the very least. Dude, like, it's not, no one's like, well, I'm a supermodel file. That's what I'm, I'm saying. I'm born like, this way, I can only... What? Uh, Megan Fox. Like, that's the only thing what? I can pop. Oh, wait. Okay, so what he's saying is he's seen men that he wants to f but he I won't be able Chat, does anyone know what is happening? I don't get it. It's, uh, as Oxiply put here, eight-dimensional gay chess here Yes. to justify their homosexuality to each other. All instead right. of instead of pieces like the horse and the you know the castle and the king, it's like a fist, a dildo, uh, a baldo, baldo. Possibly do. Like I don't. At some point, you get so fat. I don't understand the difference between right. uh, like a hundred and eighty pound woman and a hundred and eighty pound guy. I'm like, well, you guys are like. No, getting married and there, crying. Well, there is There's a, a huge difference between a hundred and eighty pound man and woman. Like, what the f is this guy on? Like, is he okay? I, I, I think he's having a, a seizure on cam. Over this shit. Like, what are you talking about? It's okay. Uh, that's you're not gay. I don't know what you are. It's not gay, but it's not great. Yeah, I, I don't understand. Like, I don't understand anything. I have always been... Yeah, I believe that. ...attracted to women who are better looking than me. Um, that like That's the crippling uh, fault that I have. And I just less hair. To, right. And I happen to yeah. dupe one. So 95% so of women... Let's go, felted, etc. Like, who, who in the world wants to hear two middle-aged weirdo degenerates talk about sex? Two, like, middle-aged... Clearly insecure men talk about sexual orientations and women. Like, who signed up for this shit? Who is like, you know what? This is really what I want to listen to. I really want to hear these two insecure, degenerate, middle-aged men who are balding and up talk about their opinions on sexuality. Women. Nobody wants this shit. No. No one cares. And you know his chat's like, what is happening? What the f Imagine being a boomer. You signed up for, during the, the, the Kyle Rittenhouse. This is how you riz them up. Okay. The fault that I have. I'm sure I just, Dick has so much riz out at the club. You know, like yeah. looking like that, sounding like that. Yeah, he's just a new model every night of the week. Yeah. Riketa is just this act like Rizzler. Come on. Does anybody buy into this shit? No. It's so stupid. I am attracted to women who are attractive. 
Thanks. Right. And I happen to yeah. dupe one into like a lifelong commitment because, well, women make bad choices sometimes. Yeah. Um, but that's that's it. But like the the this whole like, like ally thing on is on women shit. Like it's so you know, cringe. Dude. Like men never make bad choices. Men oh. are always rational. Meanwhile, that, we're looking at the two examples of like. Well, in, in, in two different ways on two different spectrums of how you could f up your life, but <laughs> that are somehow actually the same. Yeah. Where you've got one guy who just has no children, just a degenerate into his 40s, total f***ing loser, sex past hound, who, you know. Then you've got the other guy who resents having his family and children and wants to just be a degenerate, drug-addled, alcoholic, f***ing loser. And they're both just f***ing pathetic as f sitting here talking about women. Like, just get a grip. It's the horseshoe theory, right? In action. Weird. I don't know why you have to be an ally to any community, but they wear it like a badge. It's like, no, I'm an ally to the community. Why? What? Do they need your help? Like, is are they not good enough? Like, the gays can't handle it, so they need a reporter. No, they kind of do. Like, they. Oh well. Uh, well, I like how 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 Nick's trying to like make a point, and then Dick just just undercuts it. Just grabs a. Uh, uh, a wrecking ball just smashes oh. through his point. Yeah, I mean, no, actually. Well, maybe Dick's gonna say, um, "Yeah, they do. I'm one." Yeah. You know, there's it's politics. So, like the gays have their own politics, and like uh, Matt Walsh, the uh, Matt Walsh gays have their own politics. Mm. Like they're all, it's all just gay versus yeah, gay yeah. Everybody fighting. Everybody who's conservative. That's all of what politics is, is, right? That guys are weird. Yeah. yeah. I can't, I can't stand Matt Walsh. I can't stand you! All right, well that- We got out! I just, I just find both of them so repulsive on every level. I know, but There's nothing admirable about either of them. It's just You know what doing the Rakata segment's like doing? You know when you're like swimming in the pool with your friends? Yeah. And you do the who could hold your breath under the water contest? That's what it feels like. All right, Falstaff, we'll do a boss man clip and then we'll get out of here. <laughs> okay, right, right, you know what I mean? You're like, yeah, yeah. Oh, we're out. We win.